all right guys how's it going welcome back to another stream hopefully this is going actually welcome back to another star wars squadron stream i hope this is going to be the last one that we're going to be doing um the story is getting a little long i guess for a casual game get a drink of water um last thing we did was attack the skyhawk as the uh as the uh these guys the empire but I guess there's nothing else to say let's just get started here i hope you guys are all having a good fr thursday evening friday eve right friday eve it's almost friday so that's good other than that guys let's just get this thing going i hope you guys all have a good start to your weekend tomorrow let's jump right back into this and uh let's go music's going off because we are past the intro i don't remember exactly what we have to do oh yeah 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 we got to go to our briefing here the Nadiri dockyards are burning. Their Starhawk flees before us. Linden and Vanguard are within our reach. I think we saw a little bit of this yesterday. Vengeance is sweet, isn't it? But this is no time to get complacent. I've waited too long to let Linden slip away again. Admiral Sloan is. What do they say? Pride will be the death. Will be destroyed, but we cannot engage it directly. The tractor beam is too powerful. Instead, we must force them into the Ringali Nebula. There, Vanguard There's always like a three-tier plan, man. Industry. Our empire has called us to serve. We cannot fail. Okay, that was good. Let's go. I guess we are close to the end here. Uh, nobody else to talk to. How do we leave? Oh, wait, wait, wait. We need the briefing. I guess that was just a little preview of what we were gonna be looking at. But in order to stop them, I need you to break off from the overseer and fly ahead of the enemy fleet to set a trap. LT 514's calculations indicate that the remains of the Nadiri fleet is attempting to reach the New Republic capital of Chandrila. To do so, they must navigate the junkyard of scrapped Imperial ships they've been using to build that monstrous Starhawk. Poetic, <laughs> isn't it? We've detected several reactor cores in the junkyard. Titan, fly ahead of their fleet and use the cores to create a minefield on their path. Active cores will detonate when shot and devastate any ships nearby. That includes you. Wield this advantage cautiously. Destroy any Republic starfighters attempting to scout the dangers of the debris field. Your ties alone may struggle against the fleet's larger ships. Detonate the cores to take them out. If all goes according to plan, the Starhawk will either be destroyed in your minefield or be forced to divert into the deadly Ringali Nebula. Either way, we win. Okay. <laughs> Let's go. Let's get the hell out of here. For this mission, uh, you authorized to fly a TIE bomber or a TIE Reaper. No, I don't want a Reaper. That's a support vehicle. I I didn't really enjoy the the Reaper. Okay, let's uh let's look at our inventory or our, our loadout here. Uh, we only get the standard laser cannon. Okay. A multi lock or assault shield. Hmm. Oh, the proton torpedo might be good. The auxiliary beam. The beam cannon. Hold the button to fire a high damage beam that lasts a few moments. Your ship can barely turn while the beam is active. Ideal versus capital ship. Okay. All right. Well, let's just do that then. Um, yeah, give me that. And engines. Engines. I guess we'll stick with this. All right, let's launch. Let's go. So I think we're we're gonna be playing at least this one mission here, as the as the Empire, and then I think we got a couple probably to finish it off as New Republic. Titan is outbound and advancing ahead of the enemy fleet. 
Excellent. Dismantle their fleet in the debris field. They'll die here or divert the Starhawk into the Ringali Nebula. Squadron, on me. We're approaching the junkyard now. This isn't just a junkyard, Varka. It's an Imperial graveyard. How many different destroyers do you think they left out of here? And what did the Republic do to their crews? You really cannot see anything out of these TIE planes or TIE aircraft. Gosh, that's a lot of scanning. How exactly are we rigging these cores to explode? We're not. The active cores are volatile. It only takes a few shots to detonate them. So the rebels inadvertently created their own minefield. I love it. That core isn't active, so it's useless to us. Destroy it and move on. Nice find, Titan 3. It's active. I wasn't really paying attention. I feel like I got. I feel like I got a lot of those uh, kind of late there. Some of that voice acting didn't come in right on time. Got these scanned up. We'll get this one. We'll get this one. The proximity sensors on active cores will alert us to enemies in range of our explosives. If you hear the alarm, a ship is inside the kill zone. That's when we attack the cores and detonate. Oh, that's very convenient. Did I miss one? Unscan. Here we go. Oh, be careful. Stop! Unscanned core, I'm, I'm right on it. Uh, hello? Am I too close? I think I might be too close. What's going on here? Try that again. about to blow this thing up all right let's try another one maybe we have to go in a order or something oh boy one's all the way back here That's an active call. that was the last one exactly remember what I had to do. I think I have to blow up the uh, blow up the cores when they get near them. Excellent work. Oh boy. Two hits. Oh, 
That's a good thing we have these multi seek speaking missile missile. But I can't speak right now. Okay, let's just go through that. Okay, where are you? Okay, that wasn't too bad. Hopefully we don't get blown up by our own cores here, our own sabotage cores. How am I supposed to... Oh my god! I owe you my life. Hey, how you doing? Mysterious hooded figure. Nice. Alright, this kind of works out. Doing it from the back here. Oh boy, don't get blown up. Alright, I think that Corvette's done. Where? I don't see a... Oh, he's right there. Okay. Wait, no. That's gonna kill me, I feel. Oh my gosh, 10%. The 10%, we are gonna die. I'm taking damage. Thank you later. This one near a core, it is not. What core? Yeah, I guess there's la one last one here. I don't see another core. Oh, never mind. Okay, we did it somehow. Holy cow. Can I get, can I get some, can I get some armor, please? We'll be ready for them. Titan three, scan more cores. We don't have much time to rearm our minefield. Yeah. Lucky I was here. Active core. All the technology in the world, we can fly through space, but we can't. We have to scan each one individually. That will do nicely. Enemy fighters have arrived. Hunt them down. Take your damage. Show no mercy. Take your damage. We can use that one. You have a tail. If that detonates, you're dead. 
They don't explode if you don't scan it. It's kind of cheap. Oh, look, here comes the Starhawk or whatever it is. Let's blow these up here real quick. Rebel locked on. Under rebel attack. Oh, we gotta destroy the the fighters. Thing is a hog, man. I'm hit. There. Now back in the fight. Couldn't have done it without you. We got that guy. One more, one more, where is it? Here it is. That keeps hiding behind this thing. Isn't that what people were doing back when this game first start first came out? They were just hiding behind. <laughs> that one is active. Don't be too close when that detonates. I'm here. Let's go. Taking fire. I say you owe me one. I think I ended up kind of blowing myself up there. Oh wow. All X wings destroyed. The cores are safe. Another convoy of Corvettes have arrived, Titan. Titan, regroup and prepare for the ambush. We're ready. I don't even remember where we're supposed to be. Let's pull over to the side here. Did I miss it? Where's the core? Right here. Okay, I think we got two of them. Is there another one anywhere? I don't see them. They're so hard to see. There's one left. Rebels are burning. Nice shot. 
I don't have any more. Don't tell me we failed. Oh my god. Corvette's incoming. Do we have enough cores to take them out? We'd better. I mean they're not even they're not even like side by side here. If that detonates, you're dead. They locked on. They're in the blast zone. Should have picked up long range missiles. I mean, kill that core, kill those rebels. Oh, I wasn't close enough. Oh my gosh. No. Oh my gosh. That's annoying. I can't even see the cores in the field. Corvette's incoming. Do we have enough cores to take them out? Apparently not. We'd better. Watch it. Core will kill you. They're locking on. They're in the blast zone. Yeah, but I think now we're going to not have enough for these last two here. I was right on him. All right, we got one more. Do not let him escape the minefield. Only one Corvette left. Finish it. Down you go. Come on.
All right, I think we got it. I think we got it. Okay. Yes. Regroup, regroup, regroup. We are finishing this game today, guys. to follow somebody where where are you follow your attack vector Go, 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 go. Resupply available. I'll take it. Oh boy. All right, let's bounce out of here for a second. The frigate is changing course. They pot out of your trap. We need to fly ahead and find more cores. It's the only way to stop the frigate. Find more cores. God, I'm right on it. Back up. Let's back up. Right, let me jump in here. I did it. I did it. Thank God. I thought I did it too early. That's pretty cool. Nicely done. Frigate destroyed. Frigate destroyed. Okay, let's destroy this Starhawk now and finish the game. Return to the Overseer for refueling. We have them right where we want them. You know, like that's what you think. No, God! Just bounced right off of that thing. Okay. All right. Oh, we finished it? Did we dive? Yeah, we did. We died. No, we didn't die, but we didn't, like, not have to restart. Can you talk? 
No, I don't really want to talk. Let's just... Oh, we're back on the New Republic side. For the briefing. Let's just go. Let me speak plainly, Vanguard Squadron. We're in trouble. We have the Overseer behind us, and Imperial reinforcements moving to cut us off. There's no way we'll fend them off. We need to send a distress call to our allies in the New Republic and hope they can reach us in time. The problem is, we're wounded, outnumbered, and the Ringali Nebula is already disrupting our long-distance communications. Luckily, General Sindula has located an old broadcast hub that once orbited a nearby moon called Galatan. If we restore the Galatan broadcast hub, we can send a distress signal to New Republic forces outside the nebula. Chief Mechanic Zarelda Sage will lead a repair team to do just that. She'll also locate communication satellites in the area to boost our distress signal. The more active comsats we have, the stronger our transmission will be. Teresa surely knows this too. We can suffer minor losses with the comsats, but the more we have working, the faster we can signal Chandrilla for help. If the Empire's fighters must not destroy the broadcast hub, we lose that. We won't survive. Keep Zerelda and the comsats safe. I'll call for aid as soon as you get the signal strength high enough. From there, all we can do is wait and hope. This game has a serious lack of boots on the ground. Squadron flying. This is a support fighter special no. disabling enemy fighters and empowering the squadron. I don't want to I don't want to do that. Well, we don't have any options. Let's go. I, playing as the support plane is pretty bad. Pretty boring. Where are those guys running to? That's what I want to know. Okay, Vanguard. The broadcast hub is okay, I don't think we've done a mission in this plane, in this craft yet. Give an ally protective shield. Okay, so we gotta, we gotta give this dude our pr a protective shield and seeker warheads. Autonomous laser mine. All right, we got this. Well, let's get this done before the Empire notices we're out here. I'm shaking in my boots. You're not nervous. Keo, I've seen Vanguard Squadron play countless missions. What am I supposed to be worried about? All right, don't get cooked behind this thing. Vanguard, I'm in. Some mess in here. Stand by while I get this hub up and running. Look at this guy flying around for no reason at all. I wish there was a way to look hey, outside your like ship. You can deploy turret mines near an objective you want to defend. They will automatically fire. Okay, got it. Okay, so I guess that's the one over there. I'll throw one over here. Or not.
throw another seeker or mine out there i feel like that is just Am I supposed to be flying around? Uh, allies. Oh, they're down here. Where is this? These support missions are the most boring parts of this game. This, this, this NPC was saying they're in bad shape. Everybody has 100% shield. Oh, there it is. I'm not even moving. Are you kidding me? What's the point of having a ship that applies shields? Let's do my squadron again. Let's do all allies, actually. I got you. All right, let's drop let's drop another shield on this thing. 
I'm just gonna camp this thing. It's such a. Come on, come on, we gotta we gotta defend this thing. We gotta shield this thing again. Come on. Yeah, 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 yeah. Tie fighters are the worst. Oh no. All the technology in the world, and we gotta freaking worry about shields. Yes, that was. Thanks for that. So I guess we gotta go to the next one now. Oh boy. doesn't last very long. I mean, Comsat 1 is not going to make it. This, this one has really nice sounds, though.
Well, it's not going to make it. I'm giving up. I'm calling sat one. I'm um, sat one. All right, we'll hold Comsat 1. It looks like Comsat 2 is all right. Did we lose comps that one? Well, what do you, I mean, I feel like I'm in the... Compsat 2 needs... Go to 3 for a second. Oh boy. I feel like the squad is doing nothing. Oh no. Oh, we did it. No, don't shoot that thing. Don't shoot that thing. Come on.
attacking me. Okay, we got it. Holy cow. Signal's still growing, but that last concept's doing all the heavy lifting. <laughs> the Empire will not take it from us. We have one concept left. Okay. We can lose our Starhawk prototype. But not the people who built it. You're gonna help them escape. How, boss? The Temperance's hyperdrive is busted. They're working on it. But don't worry. I'll buy you enough time. Oh boy, that guy's dead. Oh yeah, he's gonna die. Project Starhawk. Maybe the New Republic itself is in your hands. All due respect, sir. You won't last a second out there alone. <laughs> alone? No. But thanks to you, I've been able to call in some help. Commander James, this is Anvil Squadron. We got your message. We're here to help. Good luck, man. Didn't we just demolish Anvil Squadron like two seconds ago? We're back on the other side. I mean, you know, you are. it's interesting, but we've done it. I don't know what the to Vanguard's think. You know, it makes me not. Do I want the Empire to win, or do I want the Rebels to win? I don't know. We have confirmation that Linden has joined the fray. That's not all. He's leading oh. the same Whoops. Rebel squadron <laughs> we decimated at Moncala. This is a calculated move. Lyndon wants me to do something reckless. He thinks he knows me. But he's wrong. We're not going to take the bait. Titan Squadron will focus on our real target. The Starhawk. Admiral Sloan is counting on us. I wish I could deal with Lyndon personally. But a commander's true weapon is a squadron. Not a starfighter. Go. Complete your mission. And if you get Lyndon in your sights, strike him down. Once Rico's Roughnecks! What's going on? I'm honored to be in the same chat as Luke Skywalker. That's hilarious. Welcome to the welcome to the stream, man. Yes, yes, yes. We're y'all here. 
This is it, Titan Squadron. Our moment of victory is at hand. The Temperance has broken off from the Rebel fleet, but no matter. Our focus is the Starhawk. And thanks to the reinforcements from Admiral Sloan, we now have it surrounded. The Starhawk suffered catastrophic damage from our Baradium assault and has had no opportunity for repair. Hey, no problem. Did you uh, you ended up getting the the uh, standard or the premium? I don't recall. Tractor beam core should turn it into a floating time bomb. I got mine. My trusty uh, standard edition right hand right here. The rebels managed to call in reinforcements of their own. Anvil squadron to be precise. Lyndon Javes is handling Anvil squadron's tactics personally. Anvil took heavy losses at Moncala, but they still have starfighters and a grudge. Destroy them. They're also fielding a nebula. They still haven't gotten the new throttle. I, I refuse to pay above MSRP Once for, for these things. The Nice. Premium is always good. Scans indicate there's an undetonated beradium missile lodged somewhere in the Starhawk's hull. Exploit that. With the hull breached, oh. a single fighter can fly inside the Starhawk to attack its tractor beam core. We have no idea what to expect. <laughs> this is what we're going to be doing? Do what this is trust. so Star Wars Episode overload, and then 4. The overseer while there's still time. All our work and sacrifice has led to this, Titan. Do not let Lyndon Jave stop you now. Who's rough next? All right, let's go. I'm gonna go ahead and say it. we're not gonna be. Uh, Captain Carroll needs you in a Tie Fighter, bomber, or interceptor. I want the fighter. Let's set it the. Nice. X-56 ball is actually pretty good. I enjoyed using that when I had mine. It's a perfect combination for any, but I agree. I would agree with that. And, and it feels good. I would agree with that. That's a, that's a, that's a fair statement. Well, Guided yeah. rotary cannon. Auto aim. Yes, I enjoy that. Why not? Uh, so what do we got here? The uh, multi-lock missile. I like, wait, 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 wait. I thought we selected this guy. Nope. Nope. I thought we selected the personal? the fighter. <laughs> Rad Jack's off next. <laughs> oh, you're a you're a uh, you're definitely a originalist. <laughs> Ro Road Jacks is it? I don't, I forgot how he says it. It's been such a long time since I've seen that movie. Okay, guided burst cannon, sure. Uh, yeah, we'll take the whole repair because we're in a, a thin skin. And, uh, what's this? No, I want this one. I like the onslaught ones. Oh, the proton torpedo. What else is this? Ion missile. Hmm. Proton torpedo. I want the onslaught missile. Uh, that's fine. I'll give up a little bit of maneuverability. For more health. Reinforced hole. Okay. I'm ready. I'm ready. Let's go. Would you like to know more? <laughs> oh, that was a quick load. I've come to expect nothing less. Rod check, yeah. Is it 100 times better than the movie? Is so campy, I love it. Follow Gray. Got a couple hits there. Let's 
Nah, I'm on, I'm on Theta SSD. We're getting a couple of these guys. All right, Rico, have a good one. Thanks for coming by, man. Looking to finish this game today, so if you want to catch the replay, you're more than welcome to. Awesome, man. Thank you. I appreciate that. Oh, I forgot. Launch countermeasures. I just ran into my own friend there. We gotta get a little bit closer for this thing. Good shooting. Shots fired. I feel like I'm actually doing all right. Not not too bad. I feel like other folks would probably be the uh Too far away. This uh, guided cannon is actually pretty long range. More like that. Lots of head-to-head -head fighting here. Oh, these A-wings are zippy. Nope, wrong one. I got two for one there. When your empire finally crumbles, you won't be there to see it. You saved my life. I'm here. Let's go. Down here. Oh, 
Oh my gosh, come on. Nice, that was good, that was good. Let's uh... Trying to do the drift, I couldn't do it. I'm... I don't have enough boost. I can't outrate this guy. Maybe we can go around this way. Oh, this is like their best pilot right here, man. This guy's doing all kinds of crazy stuff. And they got him. Oh man. Good. Now focus on that frigate. Radar here. Where is it? Where is it? Titan squadron. These Republic fools trapped, outnumbered, and they refuse to accept it. They'll call us weak, even as the might of our empire sweeps them aside. I think we got it. Yes. Yes, we heard the end. We did that one. That was us. There's another one. Enemy frigate is destroyed. 
Okay, I don't really see how the uh, Republic is going to get out of this unless they plan to... Um, It was in the front, right? Yes. If I recall correctly, it was out front. Look out. Turrets are active. You have it. Target the missile and breach the Starhawk. Take the core, Titan 3. We'll defend the breach. Bring the Starhawk down. Right. For the Empire. Oh my god. The tractor beam's containment is look, just get to the core and watch out for gravitational anomalies. Whoa. Bush. Okay, this is pretty good. No! <laughs> Okay, this is really good. This is really cool, actually. Oh, Jesus, Jesus. This is cool. This this requires a little bit of precision. This is, reminds me of landing. You got to be like on AOA and everything. Don't bump into the stuff. Yes. Wow. Okay, this is cool. You should be close to the core's emitters. Zero in and fire. Stay away from the center. Try to ride the flow around the outside. Oh, this is like a... Uh... Okay, I'm going to I'm going to die. This is like that. This is like that scene in uh, Mission Impossible. Can we turn around? Oh my gosh. 
This is pretty cool, but it's very difficult in here. I can't turn right. Just a little more. Come on. Come on, don't freaking die. All right, let's let's ride the wave. Let's see if we can ride the wave here. Oh boy. Ride the shockwave. Relax. Stay nimble and steer clear of the walls. Yeah, I mean I'm gonna I'm gonna definitely get exploded here. That better start me from there, I swear to God. Every time I've had to do that, I've I've died. No. Okay, that went a lot faster than the last time. Okay, let's hold. We have to hold. I should have saved that repair until we were a little bit more beat up. This is like a, a carrier catapult. That's going to be a pain. I can already tell that's going to be a pain. I tried to steer it through and it, it wow. And I think we're going to have to, yep. Okay. It should just start us here. You can ride the shockwave out. Come on. It might be tricky. Relax. Stay nimble and steer clear of the walls. Gravity burst incoming. Just keep it in the center. Let's go. Let's go. Gravity fluctuations might knock you off course. Titan 3, brace yourself. We made it. Jays without me. You'll have to go through 
Oh, are we the bad guys? Got him down to 54. Not getting, not getting, uh, resupplied. This dude is like cooking here and we still haven't killed him. Two, there you go. Finally. I feel like he didn't have to be out there, honestly. Classic villain mistake. Titan Squadron. With Admiral Sloan's unerring support, we have left Project Starhawk in ruins. Vanguard Squadron is doomed. Ooh. Imperial ideals have prevailed. Loyalty, duty, discipline. And with our latest champion, we shall ascend to even greater heights. 
Titan three has been promoted to flight baron with full honors. Watch out now. Well done. Your future with the Empire is bright. I take pride that the death of Lyndon Javes sends a message to all who would betray us. That wherever the enemies of the Empire may arise, Titan will be waiting, no matter the cost. This war is our crucible. We will emerge triumphant and bring this new Republic to its knees. Right, so what is gonna happen now? Come join us. Ardo confirmed what you already knew, Keo. The commander is gone. Yeah. You know he did the right thing, though. The civilians needed us. Grab the screenshot. Vanguard, where we were needed most. Of course. This is what he fought for. That's why it hurts so much. Whatever happens next, this is the end of the line. I just wanted to say, I know we haven't flown together very long, but if I'm being honest, it feels like you've always been here. I speak for everyone in Vanguard when I say, it's been a pleasure fighting beside you. I know we have a mission, but we also have each other to lean on and to protect. You've got my back out there, and I have yours, no matter what. Okay, General Sindula is waiting for us in the briefing room. Shall we? We shall. So this has to be the final mission here, for sure. I don't see how the Republic can come back from that. meeting is under such tragic circumstances. We're all feeling Lyndon's loss. He was here for like a minute. You and Vanguard have held back the Imperials. But we must get those civilian engineers out safely. I need you focused and ready to go. Lyndon saw you as a leader, an inspiration even. That's the courage I need right now. Let's get you and the others briefed. There isn't much time. Thanks to your work on the Consats, Anvil Squadron heard our call. And with Lyndon Javes bought us time to repair our ship for escape. But now the Imperial fleet has Anvil's ships pinned down. They can't get out. So we're going back into the fight. Because we need to buy everyone time to escape. No one left behind. Ardo thinks we have one chance. It's drastic. But here it is. The moon is highly unstable. And the Imperial ships are positioned around it. If we crash the star, we're going to blow up the moon. The shockwave should destroy those Imperial ships and let us escape. If we're fast. <laughs> How? The ship's tractor beam is firing uncontrollably as it overloads. If we can get a couple of Corvettes into that beam, we can tow it up to speed. Vanguard squadron, you're up first. We're counting on you to clear the path and take out the closest star destroyer. Corvettes will then enter the tractor beam. And if Ardo's plan works, get the Starhawk moving. It should have a straight shot. Defend our fleet in case the Imperials get wise to what we're doing. When the Starhawk collides with that moon, the shockwave will hit every Imperial ship in range. And you, unless you outrun it. It's risky. Risky. Sacrificing this but star damn it, it might just work. And the engineers will build the next one. And the next. The future of the new republic depends on it. Let's finish this. I'm glad you prepared that uh glad you prepared that PowerPoint presentation. Really helped put it into perspective. You'll need to be uh, your best for this one. X wing. I think we're gonna go with the X Wing. Pick whichever fighter you need. I like the I you know I actually I like the A wing the best but we cut this one like again. And yeah, we'll do repair and where is the? I don't really like waiting for the guided missile. I like I like the barrage rockets. Fine. 
You know what? I'm going to leave that right where that is. Shield regeneration plus 100% max shield minus 30. Hmm. I think I kind of want this one. All right, we'll try that. And if we die, we die. And we'll, we'll restart over if we have to. Engines. I will stick with the, the third one. All right, let's go. We're going to be in the X-Wing. Old Reliable. I think this is the last mission. I feel like this has a very last stand feel to it. Already heading in that direction. What are we? General Sindula to Imperial forces. Withdraw or be destroyed. We're in the fire now. Yeah. Time to end this for the boss. One hell of a place to fight. Yeah, it looks cool. Never seen anything like it. But I do feel like Linden has been here for like a minute. Oh, someone is going to be coming in here. Eliminate that star destroyer so we can move the star hawk into position. Uh, any advice, General? Hit the subsystems first to weaken it. Then strike with everything you've got. Just like that, huh? Eliminate that star destroyer. Like we're swatting a fighter. His shields are too strong. We gotta fly on the side and hit them. Get off. Am I even hitting this thing? Like, what am I doing? Okay, they missed their chance. Eliminate that star destroyer so we can move the star hawk into position. Uh, any advice, General? Hit the subsystems first to weaken it. Already did that. Strike with everything you've got. Just like that, huh? Eliminate that star destroyer. Like we're swatting a minor. Uh -huh. I'm gonna freaking die. Oh boy, this is gonna be annoying. I can already tell. Okay, they missed their chance. Eliminate. Could have just taken a bomber. So we can move the Star Hawk into position. Uh, any advice, General? Hit the sun systems first to weaken it. Then strike with everything you've got. Just like that. Uh, eliminate that Star Destroyer. Come on. Come on. 
We don't really have shields anymore. We should be able to power through this. Get out of here. We need to we need to rearm. I'm taking fire. Here I am. You're locking on to me. <sighs> That was too close. Fifteen percent on that targeting system. Yes, down. A little bit more. They got shields again. Oh my god, no. Oh, thank god. Thank god that was that could have been really bad.
Doing a bunch of runs this now. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. They missed their chance. Eliminate that star so we can move the star into position. Oh boy. Oh my gosh. Just like that, huh? Eliminate that Star Destroyer like we're swatting a mine out here. to be the hero. The Star Destroyer's trying to be trying to boost out of there or blast its emitter. Its shields are too strong. We've got to fly under them and hit them or we dead on. Take out the Star Destroyer's shield generators. That'll give you a clear shot at its systems. What am I doing? That was that was dumb. I can't believe I died with like two percent to okay. go. They missed their chance. Eliminate that star destroyer so we can move the star hawk into position. Uh any advice Ice General? Hit the sun systems first to weaken it. Then strike with everything you've got. Just like that, huh? Eliminate that star destroyer. Like we're swatting a mine out. We're gonna go for the shield generator first. Okay, we got the shield, Jennies. Get the power emitter. There's power generator, nice. Yeah, definitely taking down the shield generators was the right call there. Boost out of here. Let's get let's get some range on this thing. Let's get it off our tail then. That's a hit. I got you. There it is again. That doesn't sound like a conglitch. Thirty one percent. We're almost there. Preferably more than a few. 
go across the front here. Sixteen percent. They were warned. They had a chance. Well, they ain't getting another chance. Let's get it all for still then. Wait, I'm one little thing. I gotcha. That one's for the commander. The part of the ship is done for. Under heavy fire. Anything underneath that we can attack here? There we go. I think we got it. We got it. The Star Destroyer is out of the fight. Oh boy. Good job, everyone. Now form up. Come on, let's pull that son of a bitch. Regroup with the Starhawk for stage two of the plan. Static. Objective. Got it. Check. Vanguard. Looks like that signal is coming from inside the Starhawk. What? what? It's been evacuated. We have to be sure. No. Linden's in there. Yep, Linden. Oh on. What a twist. Linden? But you know the Starhawk inside out? We thought we lost you. Yeah, I'll explain later, General. Uh, what's our status? The Starhawk has a straight shot at the moon, sending in Corvettes to get it moving. Give them some cover. Corvettes? Oh, to tow the Starhawk into the moon. And take out every damn Imperial ship in range. Then count me in. Let's finish this together. Is he still out here flying around? Wow. Oh my gosh. What a... Oh my gosh. Okay. All right. I don't want to fight near the, uh, I don't want to fight near the tractor beam. Right.
can't outturn these things, man. This is a sh this is a stupid mission. The Starhawk has a straight shot at the moon, sending in corvettes to get it moving. Give them some cover. Corvettes? To tow the Starhawk into the moon and take out every damn Imperial ship in range. Then count me in. Let's finish this together. The family. Ride or die. Oh my gosh, I almost missed the button. Guy's been dodging me with nine health. Come on. Is that one dead? I'm pretty sure that one's dead. Hey, 
Almost died. Let's prove them wrong. Again. <laughs> oh my god. This game. Alright. The Starhawk's picking up speed. But it's still vulnerable. Vanguard, defend the Starhawk at all cost. Leave it to us. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh god, I crashed into this thing. Oh my god, I'm tired. All right. The Starhawk's picking up speed, but it's still vulnerable. Okay, we're going to defend the Starhawk at all costs. Leave it to us. The Starhawk's almost ready to blow. How long we got to fly escort? You see that archway between those two rocks? That's where it's headed. Once the Starhawk reaches that point, there's no turning back. Prepare yourselves. It's too bad we're losing the Starhawk like this. It was built to stop Imperial fleets, and that's exactly what it's gonna do. Thanks to Teresa, though I doubt she'd like the irony. We're picking up an incoming Imperial cruiser. Stay alert. Okay, I think I have a plan for it. I think I have a plan for it. We're going to take out the... Uh, we're going to take out the shields first, and then we're going to go for it again. Oh my god, bounce out of here. This is it. We're going to finish it this time.
get it off our tail then. Back out again, back out again. We can't let them destroy it before it hits the moon. We're not gonna destroy it. How are we looking? Starhawks halfway to the target position. And you never let them down. Okay, there we go. We got the destroyer. So many 32, 32. There's so I mean subtitles. Come on. Four. One more. One more. There we go. One more. We did it, Jesus Christ. No, why? No lag. Come on. Okay, that's pretty cool. We're gonna make it out of this, right, Keo? Right, Keo? Of course we're gonna make out of it. We're rebels. Get out of there! Get out of it! Yeah, we're Oh my god. Okay, they better start us there. I swear to god. What the?
Oh, come on. Jesus. We just spun around for no reason. Oh, yeah. Molten rock. I'm burning up in here. No time to get careless. All these rocks look the same. There's light. Follow me. We're almost out. Uh, we're clear. Are we? Are we? We did it! I think that was the ending. <laughs> oh my god. It's like the sun. If you only believe in it when you we can did see it. it, you'll never make it through. Leia Organa, really? I mean, our new republic faces great challenges. He wasn't even listening the whole time. Squadron, peace is closer than ever. General Sindula sacrificed one Starhawk for the chance to build a fleet. From Nadiri, Commander Jades will guide our best and brightest, forging the strength to challenge an empire. The war goes on, but we face it with renewed courage, inspired by heroes who fly for freedom as we emerge from the darkness of Imperial oppression. Yes, yes, Mike, I am tired. Of a new era. But we finally beat it. I think we finally beat it. That was a crap ending. Crap final sequence, too. Holy cow, guys. We did it. We did it. That was, what, eight hours? Eight hours across four streams? Something like that? Maybe six hours? Holy cow. There's no music because I turned off all the... Uh, I turned off the copywritten music. Um, why isn't that playing? There it goes. <laughs> Mike, we did it. We did it. Jesus. This thing is like focusing on the wrong thing here. <laughs> oh man, I this is like I'm starting off the year pretty good here. This is the this is like the second game I beat the whole year. Most of the time, I only beat one or two games a year. I'm already up to two. Let's see. We got to wait for the after credit scene, right? There's always an after credit scene. Oh, my gosh. All right. Can't believe we beat the game. It's not even a hard game. It's just at the end, it got a little annoying. But I'm just glad we beat it. Yeah, it was two hours, Mike. <laughs> Dude, it was two hours yesterday. And that, mind you, like, I wake up, like, at 6.30 in the morning. So I'm staring down at this 10 o'clock time here for me. <laughs> oh, man. I'm tired. 
Let me try to read some names. Jennifer Williams, Andrew Lucas, Ian Bowles, Julian Vachon, Vachon, Adam Caron. Thank you for making the game. We gotta wait for the after credit scene. Overall though, this game is pretty good. I wouldn't say it's a top game. It is a top game of 2020. Not a lot of good games came out in 2020, I don't think anyway. I would say it's a solid, a solid three and a half, four out of five. It doesn't have much of a story. I don't like that you play both sides, but it was still a pretty fun game. And it was fun on the joystick after you get it figured out. There were some moments there. There were some moments there. All right. Hey, IT gets a credit in this thing. Look at that. They had one system administrator and one IT site manager. And two service specialists. Poor guy. Only two techs on the whole team. We did it, boys. We did it. I'm happy, man. I'm glad we were able to beat the game. I was a little worried we were not going to... I thought we were going to finish it yesterday. But damn, I guess I was wrong. These last couple of missions took a while. I was like just basing it based on how long it took us to beat the other missions in the beginning. It was like 20, 30, 20 to 30 minutes. And then they were saying you could do them in like 13 or 15 minutes. So I figured we could probably blast through them, but... It took a little longer than I thought. Bioware Austin. I didn't know they were level designer. Well, you just put a couple assets out there and an Unreal Engine. Make sure you have pretty graphics from the artist. Player plus team. What does that mean? What does that even mean? Seed. Not like a environmental thing. Hey, corporate leadership. Andrew Wilson. He gets the credit. Guess he did. Okay, the project. Fine. EA Romania, they do the QA. I'm, I'm tempted to skip this damn thing. You know what's funny? I said I was going to stream less and here I am streaming the entire damn week. Okay, that's the third. This is song number three. How long are these credits? This is way on Star Wars music, but I don't want to get copyright strike. <laughs> so this is what you get. You get stream beats. We're just waiting for this thing guys if you've made it this far hit the like button hit the subscribe share this stream with a friend good god oh my gosh how many more credits i'm gonna skip it no don't skip it don't skip it And then we have the race tomorrow, GT3 is tomorrow, which I got to check where we are. I may or may not stream that race. I can't promise anything at this point. Especially after my last sim racing stream. I 
Star Wars would have tanked in this one. <laughs> the original soundtrack. Yeah, perhaps. Jo John Williams, right? I mean, is uh, a little bit better, a little bit more uh, epic than <laughs> Stream Beats. Gameplay services. What does that even mean? What does gameplay services even mean? What do they do? I'm about to skip this. I'm about to skip this, guys. Oh my god. A junior, four junior software engineers. We're done. We're skipping this. You completed the single player story and have been awarded the following items. Check the customization menu. Starbird, Squadron, and Suppressor. Paint job. Okay, great. <laughs> oh my god. That was... I feel like this game was only like six hours, six or eight hours. But damn, it felt so long. Oh, we have a loot box. Is that a loot box? No, that looks like a currency. Oh, no. SRS Sebring? Yeah. SRS Sebring is the... Yeah, that's a yikes. That's a yikes. Okay, where are the loot boxes? Customization, maybe? Let's go check out the loot boxes before we call it a night here. Let's see. Is it loadout? All right, we got, nice. this is our new one. Yeah, oh, oh wow, look at that, rust bucket. Wait, I don't have that or I can unlock it for 1200 of those points. Why would you, oh, this one is kind of crazy. Of course, the only one we have is this crappy starboard squadron one. What else do we have? Decals. We don't have any decals. Can we get a baby Yoda? No. This one. Oh, I should have probably bought one of these. It would have been more interesting to look at. Can you guys even see it? Yeah, you can barely see it. Oh, we could get a baby Yoda. Look at that. All right, we'll get that. I'm never gonna, I don't know why I bought that. What is that? Oh, what about hanging thingies? I already spent all the money. Millennium Falcon 400. Oh, what a coincidence. That's exactly how much we have. Are you telling me I missed out on these cool little decorations the entire time? Ooh, those look like fingers. All right, we'll roll with this one. <laughs> you got it. There you go, perfect. <laughs> All right, guys. Um, I think we're gonna call it right there. Guys, I hope you enjoyed the stream. I hope you guys enjoy watching that entire playthrough of Star Wars Rogue Squadron. It's not 100%, but it's just the main story beats. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I I had fun playing it. There was a couple frustrating bits. There's a little bit of a learning curve on the uh, on the button mapping, stuff like that. But overall, that was a pretty fun game. I'd give it a four out of five-ish, maybe a three and a half, four out of five. Let's call it a 3.75 out of five. Yeah, for real, those things were pricey, man. The game is only 40 bucks, but it, it's pretty good for $40. I mean, you could watch two movies for 40 bucks, or you could play this game for eight hours. I don't know. It's up to you. It's up to you. I don't know when we're going to be streaming again. I think we might be back either Saturday or next Monday. Um, I'm not too sure. I do have to record a video. That's my goal for the next week. I want to put out a video... Uh, 
talking about the experience with this flight stick and uh, Star Wars Squadrons and kind of my setup for it. I think I've learned a little bit over the last couple of streams uh, playing this game. So I'll share that with you guys. Hopefully some folks can learn a couple things or maybe find it useful. Okay, guys, that's going to be it for me. Mike, thank you so much for coming by. Rico's Roughnecks, thank you so much. Uh, who else came by? I think I think uh, we had uh, Senor... Uh, oh, wait, wrong computer. Or, and Mysterious Hooded Figure. Thank you for coming by. All right, folks, we are done. 3.75 empanadas out of five. That's right. <laughs> Oh, man. Sometimes I do miss the Discord. Sometimes I do miss the Discord. Listen, guys, go and uh, uh, short GME or whatever the, the meme is. Go 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 and do that. <laughs> All right. Not financial advice, by the way, quote unquote, or whatever. <laughs> guys, have a great rest of your day. Mike, have a good one, man. Thank you so much for coming by. Thank you, guys. Have a great day, guys. Enjoy the enjoy your weekend. Oh, seven.